Kay from Cupcake and Pie. Today we're at Disneyland celebrating Valentine's Day. We hope to find some really cute merchandise to show you. And they're also doing annual pass holder days. We got our wristbands to go see a movie later on about um, Disneyland at the World's Fair. Thanks for coming today. I'm share with you today what I'm wearing from head to toe. I've got this pink scarf in my hair that I bought, I believe, from Tatiana online. I've got lots of flair today. I've got my annual pass button that I just got for the show we're going to see later. I got my name tag that says Princess Pie that I got from Etsy. I got this um, heart brooch I've had for a really, really long time. And of course, my D for match accessories. My necklace is also from Etsy and I wore it because it reminds me of Valentine's Day, kind of candies that you'd want to eat and snack on. Um, my dress is pinup girl clothing. It's the Heidi dress. Um, it comes, I believe, with a red belt, but I put the purple one to kind of change it up. And my shoes are some pink Converse and I have a pink poofy today that I got from Amazon. And I have lots of heart jewelry, heart. Uh, bracelet, heart earrings, and I always have my heart rings, so I'm all Valentine's Day out. Today I'm wearing a red dress from Steady.com, and I also have a pink poofy underneath from Amazon, and my black ballet flats. I put on all my heart jewelry. I've got my heart earrings from Tiffany's, and my Return to Tiffany's heart bracelet as well. And I got some new statement rings off of Poshmark the other day. Pow, pow! So check out my rings. The link for the seller at Poshmark I'll put down below in case you want to check out the rest of her closet. And I also am wearing fake eyelashes today for the first time. I got those on Amazon and I know I'm going to have a lot of fun with them. In the past, I feel like there's been a lot more effort towards Valentine's Day here at Disneyland Resort. This year all we found was this little Cupid Mickey and I found this trading pin. Last year I felt like they had some really cute decorations on Main Street USA. Um, I got a picture in front of it, I'll post it on Instagram to show you, and this year we couldn't find anything. What'd you find, Cupcake Killer? I found an I'm with Cupid mini to go with the Cupid Mickey and one Yoda Valentine's Day pin. So like Princess Pie said, usually there's a lot more merchandise here and this year... Have you guys been to Disneyland lately? Have you found any merchandise that we missed? If so, comment and let us know below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We're here with Renitra and Jamie. So how long have you guys had Disney passes? Um, I've had my pass now for at least two or three years. Um, got it several years ago, interestingly enough, was not working and needed a Disney day. And my friend surprised me with a one day park hopper, which I turned into my pass. Very and nice. it kept ever since. Oh, what a nice yeah, gift. Yeah, great gift. gift that keeps on giving. Yes. Giving. <laughs> How about you? Uh, I started in 2009 as a pass holder, and then I just kept renewing. And renewing. Very Because like, cool. that's when they started doing the monthly plans, so that's why I started. Makes it more affordable, easier yes. to yes. get the higher pass. Right. Are you guys both premium? Yeah. Pass yes. 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 I'm premium. I'm, I'm in the last slate of the premium pass holders. So unfortunately, this year when I upgrade, I would have to step up one versus before I was the top tier. Right. Now I'm the second tier. <laughs> sad face. Hashtag yeah. sad face. Hashtag <laughs> but yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 At least um, when I renew, it's gonna. I'm going to Florida, so I'm just gonna get the premier pass. Oh, very cool. And so, yeah. I've so. got passes at both this year, too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited. Yeah, it's very fun. <laughs> very fun. Very cool. So tell us about dressing up when you guys come to the park. Why do you do it? What kind of reactions do you get? Do you dress up every day? Um, pretty much, yeah. Like, whenever I'm going somewhere, I try to. I think yeah. I dress up, for the most part, all the time. It's kind of an M.O. of mine. I think... Um, here in particular, it's interesting when you dress up, particularly when you wear vintage fashion because most people aren't used to seeing it and so they kind of give you the side eye, you know, uh, are, you a, are you a cast member? 
Are you, is there a special occasion? Is it Dapper Day? Yeah. yeah. Are, you are, wearing a costume? are you wearing a costume? <laughs> yeah. um, is, you know, and so you get lots of different questions, lots of, you know, trying to figure out why you're dressed up, which is really interesting to me because I'm trying to figure out why you're not yeah. a little bit, but you so know, to each his own. Yeah. Yeah. Yoga, pants. yoga pants. I get it, but. You know, rolling well, you're on, on your way to yoga. You know? Yeah, <laughs> that's the thing. Yeah. You know, people who wear the yoga pants don't look like they've been doing yoga. Yeah, yes. 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 just saying. Yes. Just saying. Yes. Yeah, just that's okay. Yeah, but I but think I it, right. I think at the park, it's become definitely a time in the '50s when the park opened and people wore their Sunday best. Now people kind of roll out of bed and kind of just wear anything. So I think that's probably why there's a bit of a shock factor because people aren't used to seeing people dressed up I think just in general yeah wait now. till you go to Florida dressed up oh my goodness. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah there's nobody in Florida dressed up yeah, yeah they're all they're everywhere. all shorts and flip-flops because <laughs> all work out there I yeah. feel like that when other places from what I've heard like Tokyo um they're very fashion forward there yes. I think um Paris I don't know about there, but I know Tokyo is probably way more fashion forward than we could ever be here. Because um, it's understood there. Here, I feel like when you do that kind of step over what's normal, people are really like, whoa, what is that you have going on? <laughs> yeah. And did you guys come today for a special reason? Uh, uh, Galentine's. Yeah. Just, yeah. Out with the girls. Hanging out with our girlfriends for you know pre Valentine's festivities, yeah, luncheon, nice. and because um, this weekend marks the Chinese New Year. Very Happy good. Chinese New Year! Yeah. Um, okay, celebration of the <laughs> Year of the Monkey. Um, we I came particularly because I wanted a picture with Mulan and Mushu, which is rare occurrence that she's ever out. Two and a half hour waits did not happen, unfortunately, but. Yeah, so fun times, just hanging out with the girls. <laughs> Tell us about what you're wearing today. Uh, <laughs> you actually, this is me dressed down. Like, okay. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah I, I just got this dress. Uh, I think it's it's either like Barrow Wing or Candies from Kohl's. It's got heart. It's a heart in the bag, and I Very just wanted cute. hearts and like pink and Valentine's and my crown. <laughs> so, Very cute. Yeah. <laughs> just, and I am wearing um, vintage, uh, true vintage, just quilted circle skirts from Meow in Long Beach. Um, this is vintage I've had in my collection for a while. Betsy Johnson, Betsy Babe. Um, and actually I'm wearing new ears. I just got from, um, I believe her name is SME Creations on Instagram. Very she cool. makes spe uh, specifically sequined ears. Oh, they're yeah. so pretty. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, she makes ears. So, okay. yeah. Well, thanks you guys for taking the time to talk with us today. Oh, and sure. we will see you again around the parks. Always. Great. Anytime. Awesome. See you real soon. Valentine's Day from Cupcake and Pie. Today we're at Disneyland celebrating Valentine's Day. We hope to find some really cute merchandise to show you. <laughs> I said that's all